Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to the Calm Before the Storm mod for Hearts of Iron 4. I'm your host, Mr. Muckle Lover. And right now, I've accidentally, like, already completed the Zavod number 10, Schwickel. Focus! A shipyard in McMonts will be useful as a supplement to the White Sea Fleet and help us deliver around October to our enemies. Now, we got about a year, roughly a year before things get really historical, but Zavod number 363. Situated in Leningrad, Plant 363, the People's Commissary out of the defense industry, should be expanded to improve our mine sweeping and torpedo capabilities. And then. The Severnaya Sudostroidelnya uh, Verf, also situation, situated in Leningrad, Shipyard 190, named after Zidanov's well, will be used to improve our Baltic fleet. So, right now, Mikhail Buglakov dies. Mikhail Afanisevich Buglakov, one of the most celebrated authors, has died today of nephrosclerosis, as his father had tomorrow. A funeral will be held at the HQ of the Union of Soviet Writers. He is famous for the White Guard and his play, The Cabal of Hypocrites. It was also written in The Fatal Eggs and the Heart of a Dog, which made him seem counter-revolutionary to the government. However, his last works, The Master and the Margarita, remains unpublished. Don't you know that manuscripts don't burn? But right now, we've got a good amount of guns, artillery's okay, we need way more support equipment and tanks, just because, well, as some of you guys did put in the comments from the last video, we're gonna get a little screwed here, just a little bit, so really, we should probably be pumping out quite a few more military factories from here on out. Um, yeah, it's not gonna be good for us, no, is it? No, it ain't, but that's alright. When is it ever good for us? Well, we'll see what happens. Especially with Max Buff Germany. Uh, we'll see. Oh, let's take a look. So, it is April 8th, 1940. Can I send you volunteers? Oh, I wanna see how bad we're gonna do against these guys. Oh, uh, y'all have 18 divisions. Y'all have 12. I don't, definitely don't want to send those tanks over. Um, these cavalry divisions are not great. We did throw some bicycles in there as well. 16, uh, let's see. Um, 16, you know what? Screw it. You guys come over here. We need another general. Cut it. Oh, Karel. Karel will be fine. Alright, so do we have any planes? If not, oh, that's going to be really bad for us. But, we can send how many? 166. Fighters, um... Honestly, I think just sending in a fighters is probably going to be the best bet. So, yeah. Any other fighters? Yes, we do. Oh, and make sure... Oh, and they join the allies, of course. 66. There we go. Oh, never mind. 67 now. And there goes uh, you guys, too. Uh, very nice. Good luck, guys. Good luck. You're going to need it. Oh, boy. And we're going to need it, too. So... We keep building ourselves up. We need way more support equipment. We need way more. Just oh, hello. Oh, they took us out, broken. Oh, they're actually doing. You know, this is Cortez. They should be able to defend very well. Of course, I guess the, uh, the Spanish Republic is in there too, but the Dutch are dying. So, all right. Let's see how badly we're gonna lose here. Um, you guys do this. Of course, we do need that army XP. Um, Clement, uh, let's look out for him. It's fine. You guys are still assaulting, while the Germans are assaulting up north. So, yeah, we'll see. We'll see how well we can do with these guys. Probably not that great, but you never know. Panzer expert, yeah, might as well. Cool, and it's coming up. And this one's not doing too bad either. And we've got quite a few more comments to go through, but let's see. Ooh. Ooh. I think I'm, we might want to invest in some anti-tank. That might be very beneficial, but you never know. Um, yeah, some of these guys are real weak. That many tanks? They got a lot of infantry. So, yeah. War propaganda would be pretty nice. But we're going to restore order in the Ukraine? No. We're going to go and restore more order in Latvia, Lithuania, and these guys. Because we want these to be cores. We can send our NKVD spies to take down a cell. We tried that earlier, actually off screen. I tried that off screen. And we lost. So, their strength is 30 now, which sucks, but whatever. And Zavald, number 69892. A ship here in the Far East will help us fight off the Japanese or Chinese, should we need to. So we're just, we're trying to beeline for as much stuff as possible. Uh, what is 1940? Uh, get some better guns, yeah. Ooh, it's not looking good. A lot of red. Not good at all, my friends. Ooh. Well, combo with is no, not change too much. Infantry. Oh, yeah, I did. There you go, 19. We well, got more bodies. And now we're out of guns. God dang it. Then again, we make country 27 every single day, so we'll see what happens. Throw them bodies in there. Oh, Karel, you're learning a lot, because it's not going to be looking pretty soon. So after this stuff is done, um, we're going to keep doing this stuff, but really, I think what we're going to really focus on um, is not dealing with the devil, but more military stuff here, as best as we can. 
Uh, down here, uh, I'm pretty sure just take up anti-German positions. Definitely not dealing with the devil. And foreign policy adventures, definitely not. So we'll definitely go down this way. And meeting in Paris, we'll probably do overtures of London. Yeah. Yeah. And who can we go to war with now? Oh, Paul. Yeah, no, 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 no. They're in the Allies. That's a big old mistake. No, 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 no. Well, we're still trying to hold out. How many men have we lost? Oh, 18,000. That's not good. Oh, those German boys are coming in pretty darn fast. They got so many planes. Holy crap. Yeah, we're going to need some anti-tank on those bad boys there. Um, yeah, that's not bueno. Uh-oh. There goes Luxembourg, too. Keep doing the best you can. Oh, Kurel, Kurel, are you learning anything? Bro, please learn something. Should have got more anti-air. Yeah, I don't know. We're probably going to not do very well here. This is like this, for realsies. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we're going to some anti-tank. That's what we're going to get next. I usually don't build it, I think, but I want to see if we could drive without it, but... Looks like we're going to need it. We're going to really need it. We got all the millies done? <laughs> lies. <laughs> what a bunch of lies. Um, build in here, too. It's fine. Get more refineries, too. That'll be good. We're trying the best we can. Max out Germany is not easy to beat. <laughs> Disappointed that Cadell's not doing much. Uh, take down his cell. Let's well, try it. Try it again, because why not? Please do not get encircled. We do have green air, though. That's kind of surprising, not going to lie. They have just so many planes. Oh, there goes France. France is dead. Oh, we. Oh my gosh, we lost a division already. Uh, 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 that's not good. Hmm. Wow, we did, we lost 45,000 men. Holy crap. Adolf, you are so strong. Wow. Um, maybe hold out here. I, mm, if you lose Paris, you lose Paris. You know, it is what it is. That's not our place. Yeah, let's, let's have a get some anti tank. Holy crap. Oh, we're have some anti tank. We're not making any anti tank? Oh, well, that's what we gotta make now. Anti tank. Could use a few more guns. Support goes pretty bad, though. Uh, we got... Oh. You guys are 40 count with? Nice. We have the NKVD, of course. Keep doing stuff like that. We need more war support, too. Oh, is Paris going to... Yeah, I think they got him. Yeah. Some comments. Someone says, Hopefully we won't regress... Or regret Max buffing Germany. I probably will regret that. Someone says, Is there no calking goal, goal here? You know, the incident with Japan in here? Apparently not. Um, do more, get more small arms and field hospitals. Do a USSR Cold War Iron Curtain historical run. So, we'll see what happens. What if I see in the end? Oh, hello. Uh, this is awkward. I don't want to delete these divisions, but if I have to, I will. Okay, thanks game. Thanks so much. That was a mistake. Wow, this is really bad. Holy cow. What the heck is this? Military administration of Valonia? Falkenhausen? What? Holy cow, this is disgusting. Hope these guys are dug in, because Jesus Christ, we lost a lot of guys. Um, guns are not looking great. Artillery's looking pretty good, though. Motorcycles, motorized, support equipment. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That's all I can say. Oh, we're not ready for this. We're not ready for any conflict like this. I have a feeling we might lose very hard here.
At least we're all done with that stuff. The fourth to five year plan, now we're good for now. Um, rocket artillery, motorized infantry. If we can carry our infantry with trucks or half trucks, and we can save them time and energy, thus improving our fighting ability. Okay, so the Finns are going to attack us again. Uh, guaranteed. Just, that's just guaranteed. I hope this historical game turns ahistorical and, like, Turkey joins the Allies or something. Then again, that could be really bad for us, too, so... Um, can we get any more field marshals or generals? Failure in Chechnya. What the heck? After heated gun battle, then KVD spies have been captured and killed by insurgents stolen in the Chechen village. Let's rob this of semi-valuable spies and has given the insurgents a larger stockpile of weapons and ammo. What the heck? What are we supposed to do about that? Nothing. There's literally nothing. They attack. The Chechen guerrillas have attacked one of our military outposts. Using an explosive, they caused damage to Soviet military railways and killed a few military personnel. Most notably, they've seized a number of modern weapons which are likely used against us. Uh... Hand of the capitalists, the nationalist powers are a viper in Europe ready to strike when they see an opportunity. To prevent these strikes from reaching the USSR, we must ally with capitalist power to ensure collective security. Well, we don't like to, but we're going to have to. I we need more armies down here too. God dang it. Yeah, that's not going to be enough. Way more guns are going to be needed now. I'm not sure if there's really anything you could do. I mean, we're trying to max out everything we've got here already. I mean, look at all the military factories we're trying to build right now. That's definitely not going to be enough against the Germans. Oh my goodness. Here's the guy to do something. Aftermath of the Great we're going to rebuild that. Let's go ahead. Boom. Yay. But this we did get more army XP from that last thing we did, so. Not a complete wash. <clears throat> 17,000. This is going to be dropping every single day, which is nice. Uh, how do we make you guys 40 combo with? Because right now, infantry divisions are one combat width ish. Well, let's just throw in the artillery. Four artilleries. Actually, we could probably throw in more artillery because they should have quite a bit of organization here, right? Uh, what did we do with that? 36, 8, 39.2. You lose some more organization. You get more soft tech. It costs quite a bit more manpower, though, which does suck. Breakthrough does go up quite a bit more. More weight, supply usage. Recovery does go down slightly, but you get way more HP, so. Forty point eight was not worth it. I don't remember which one, which is a good one to use. Let me just change you to this uh, artillery. Thirty nine, eh? Not as good. So we need some serious anti tank here. Oh, this is not going to be good. We need more guns. We need more support equipment. We're not ready for any sort of war. Holy smoky fathers! Um, you guys, you twenty four are nineteen point two, which is not bad, but. Oh boy. Well, so much for the Chechens, I guess. Restore order in Lithuania, might as well. Former departments, good. Keep doing that stuff because we're going to need it. Oh boy. I'll probably start doing the German uh, thing there. That'd be very nice, very nice, very nice. This is disgusting. Why did you guys mess this up so badly? Break the priorities, not bad. And then, yeah, that's not going to help us out that much, but whatever. Keep making more goddamn military factories. Collectivization is over. 90% of farmers have been collectivized, so Comrade Stalin has decided that our uh, collectivization campaign is successful enough and resources should be invested in other areas of development. Furthermore, Comrade Stalin knows how precar precious or precarious the situation is. If we do not stop now and at least let some peasants work on their own, they could face total collapse. Memory collectivization, alright. Memories, huh? Um, take up anti German positions. Oh. Well, if the Germans are the biggest threat to the USSR, we must cooperate with either the British or the French to, to strangle the Sovanches' power early. Yeah, oh well. Um, oh. Small efforts. Support. Well, it is 40. Uh, small arms efforts. We have to take some steps to ensure that our infantry have the most modern equipment on hand. Yeah, you can definitely tell when the, when the game lagging pretty hard, because it's lagging pretty badly when you can't get a 10-day focus done. Oh, it smokes. Oh, how are we doing with the ships? How are you guys doing? Hanging out, having a good time? There you go. Go home. Go home. Shouldn't even need to. I don't want you to be completely garbage, but still. Better Artie's very nice. We might use anti-air as well. We'll see. 
But we just need so many military factories now. Holy crap. That's not bad. That's getting much better. That's getting a little better, too. We need way, way more light tanks, way more fighters. Oh, my gosh. We're just not ready for war. French state looking... Not bad, actually. Should order in Estonia? Yes, please. And we'll sort some of this up, too. That'll be good. Where is that? Down here somewhere? No? No issues? Zero issues? Okay. Oh, it's in Ukraine and Caucasus. Or as is in general. Cool. Uh, more divisions, nice. God, I want more generals. There, you can go with 10. A really not great army. Huh. <laughs> yeah, we're not really getting some guns. I want... We need more artillery. Obviously, we're trying to make these guys close to 40 combo with ish, but... We'll see. But after this one... Auxiliary units. To ensure that our army can function fluidly, we need some auxiliary units to provide a supplement in some specialized areas. Might as well, right? Get some support attack. That'd be really nice. Uh, party control coming source. That wouldn't be bad either. But I do want to get. I just want to race the land auction because we're we're still trying to do it, even though we are finishing it up pretty quickly. Yeah, there's only one more after this one. Mm, yeah, we're gonna suck so hard. Suck so hard here. Oh my goodness. Um, actually, since you're done. Oh, there goes those guys. I don't want to send divisions over because we're going to get encircled and stuff. I guess it's that's good that the mm, allies have Republican Spain. I guess that is a pretty good benefit for us. So, and now we reset production, but still 100 days, not bad. Uh, Roosevelt wins re-election, very good. And armored effort. The key to our tactics is a tank, the weapon capable of punching lines through enemy forces and allowing our soldiers to develop them. Yeah, I guess. If we can beat up those guys quickly enough, that'd be really nice. Actually, is the Kingdom of Norway in the German sphere? It's not yet. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I forgot that Spain died. My bad. My bad about it earlier. Holy, how did they die so fast? Oh my gosh. Now I'm gonna. I really regret Max buffing them out. Now. Oh, they're winning so well in in Africa too. Oh, this is not a good idea. I might have to. Mm. Holy crap. Look at all the stuff they have. Say so 35. The rebels have control many villages on the countryside and are established in base support. They have also many modern weapons they can use against us, and attacks will come at a moderate frequency. There's nothing else you can do. You have to do this. I'm not sure what else you can do about that. I don't think there is anything you can do about that. Uh, I'm not ready for Operation Barbarossa, please. Please. Are we still producing more millies? Good. Keep them up. Keep them up. It's fine. We can make more aluminum. We can import some more. Oh, not from you guys. Netherlands. Sure. Dong Bay, huh? God dang. Why do they cost so much? They attack. All right, we're gonna put that. Please go ahead. So there's nothing we can do. That's stupid. Completely stupid. I hope we can beat the Finns up. I re or yeah, I really hope we can beat them up, man. What? Okay, so then gave these spies have found that Hassan Erezrelov and his brother Hussein have organized 41 meetings to recruit guerrillas and sympathizers. Their instruction is growing steadily. We must take action. Stop this! We're what? what? There's nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do about this. What? This is the third time in a row, and we still can't do anything about them. As we would just fight the crime wave, maybe? Is that it? Maybe that's it. I don't know. Please let me know if you know in the comments below, because I obviously don't know. Alright, so the more seconds are being filled out, we're going to need some serious anti tank here. And. Oh, rocket artillery? Okay. The ability to send self propelled shells over long ranges will do a great deal to improve the quality of our uh, artillery support. It's a lot. Still, I'm in Chechnya. After a heated gun battle, NKBD spies were forced out of a Chechen village with heavy loss while they were able to inflict casualties on the enemy. They still failed to take down the cell. 
Insurgents can now scavenge weapons and ammo from the fallen agents and use those against us. This we know there's still there. God, I hate this. Conduct carpet bombing? Might as well. It's better than using political power, I guess. Restored in the caucuses? Might as well try. Aftermath of the Great Wound? Wait, Great Purge? Nice. Slightly more organization? Hopefully that does help us out in our wars, but... We'll see, man. We'll see. God, I'm not feeling confident about this at all. We need political power, too, to make more uh, manpower. Rocket artillery. I want to do doctrine effort, but... Let's go party control commission, maybe? The party control commission should be subordinated to the central committee of the party rather than allow them to function independently. Because you can always use more political power, consumer goods, all that good stuff, too. Oh, boy. Oh my gosh! Our recent military operation in Chechnya failed to eliminate a known cell. Instead, analysis reveals that we have inflicted civilian casualties. This is only increase the morale of the Chechen separatists. What's the point of this? Just kill them all then. Actually, we need to start forming another army down here. These guys up here will be fine, probably, but. Screw it. We need them now, sort of ish. Of course, I could always demand Odessa, right? Continue the war in religion. Ah, so we're playing Bessarabia, I mean. Bessarabia and Bukovina are historical regions of the uh, Russian Empire. We must claim the territory as our own, so it contains a vital port. I'll have to get this area and just defend here. Do Nord. Oh. Man, we have, like, no political power. I hope America gets involved. I mean, it's kind of cool to see the Allies have invaded you know, Sicily, but Italy's still struggling with these guys, too. But then again, Italy's not that great, but still. Still. Uh, let's see. And you guys go right here. Because you can. It's already March. Oh, God, no. How many weeks? Ten days? That's not bad. Best Robbie, we might as well try it. And then we can demand it. We talk Iran. Demand Greater Armenia. Uh, be demand Bessarabia. We shall submit a demand to the government of Romania demanding that they turn over Bessarabia and Bukovina over to us on the threat of war. Still got some resistance up here, huh? That sucks. Combat unit. Oh, they joined the Axis. That's not good. I hope they give it to us, but there's no guarantee. Yeah, there's nothing we can do here. But there's nothing we can do. I mean, you've seen us try and try and try and try and try, and there's nothing we can do. And we need we need we need extensive conscription. It's not enough. We only have a core population of 183 million, which is not enough. But whatever. The man greater Armenia. The Turkey owns territory claimed. But uh, oh, look at that. Come on, on Arme by Armenian Georgian nationalists. Perhaps if we occupy them, the nationalists will get less uppity. Actually, Republic of Armenia. I mean, they, should, they should go to war with us, right? The Romanian government has capitulated to our bands and have ordered the retreat of all military and administrative uh, personnel from Basarabia and Biocalvina. We're now free to occupy the region. Nice. Should make it slightly easier to defend for now, but it's already April. I'm not feeling really good about this. We need more manpower. At least that's good to get. Feel we should be fine. Get more cap and growth. I am just worried. Especially with no political power. Moldova? Oh, we get cores in a year? We need that manpower. Yeah, I don't know, ma'am. It's not looking good for us.
I mean, we're trying. You see this. We're pushing hard for more uh, factories and stuff. Oh, I forgot about Yugoslavia, too. Don't fall too fast, Yugoslavia. Oh, the Greeks are losing, too. Well, I mean, they did hit, technically lose historically, so. And they attack. They all pay for this. God dang it. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. UK. Not bad. So what are the Turks say? They are hunting over Greater Armenia. Turkish administrative and military personnel have left Western Armenia and Georgia, leaving us to occupy this territory. We have thus reconquered another province. Ah, victory. We take Salem, Salem. Operation... Oh. Attack Iran. The Imperial State of Persia must be forced to give up their northern territories to secure the Caspian Sea. If we can, we should also establish a communist satellite regime. Wow, was that historical? Oh, boy, never mind, never mind. We got some other things to focus on right now. Comrade citizens, brothers and sisters, many of our men of our army and navy, the enemy has come to our gates and demands our submission. The workers, peasants, soldiers must all work tirelessly to ensure the life of the Soviet state. Our great nation, led by our dear leader, will surely triumph over the Soviet bandits and bring the USSR to new heights. The enemy is armed to the teeth with weapons, but, o but only we are armed with the spirit of the nation. Forward to a victory. Oh, we changed our focus here immediately. Oh, how does it change? Oh, it drastically changes. Holy crap. Move towards war economy. War is upon us. Yeah, I'll probably do that one. Well, that doesn't seem really good for us. Free political prisoners. Guardians are... Oh, yeah, I'll probably be good to do. Um... Mm. Probably guard units. Old rank of guards will be introduced introduced for those who show exemplary skill and combat and loyalty to the nation. Can you guys actually win here? A lot of it's turning red, so I'm thinking now. Slovak State, yeah. Makes sense, man. See, I knew they'd do that, too. Can you guys actually win here? You might actually be able to win here still, though, which is pretty nice. Um, thing is, though, we have no manpower, so... Yeah, that's not good. But I'm Jill. Nice. Just slowly pushing in. Alright, where is it? Anti air. We don't have enough of anything, really. Uh, for you guys, 40s. You need logistics. Go with anti. Oh. You take this off, but it does give so much. Take off logistics. Go with anti tank here. It's fine. Just make it like two divisions at least. 40s for now. Maybe. We'll see. Ooh, they are attacking us. That's not good. Right there. Yeah, they actually win here, maybe. You might be able to, actually. If you don't have buys or anything, you might be able to win, maybe. Maybe not. How are we doing over here? Doing okay? Work time administration, that'd be nice, but we don't really have that right now. Come on. Come on. There we go. We actually circled a division. Nice. Someone does say that we probably have to go invade all the way into the Rhineland to kill these guys off. We'll see. Um, oh, yeah, that's true. It's fine. And with you guys. <laughs> Romania, sure, why not? We'll get that from you for now. 
All right, so how many random villas? Eight for thousand is not too bad. Versus fifty-nine thousand. Okay, not terrible. Could be better. Might as well. Two two seven. More than thirty percent center progress. Oh boy, they're getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Oh, uh, sure, guys. Why not? Um, oh, three millies, huh? That <laughs> lies. Uh, that too. How much are we missing? Oh, so many guns. So many guns. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Ooh, where do you get that? Yeah, you're still holding out, which is good. You guys are struggling, definitely, but... Where are the tanks? Send the tanks back up here. Government cipher schools. Oh, it's a mess. Oh, it's... It doesn't help them have no generals, though. After another great purge. Okay, cool. Rodina and Nation. Recovery rate goes up. Remove political commissars. Encryption. Not bad, not bad. So by pre-Soviet officers. Women in aviation. Therefore, it's army improvements. Cult of sacrifice. More attack is nice. You take designs. Cayucho? I see it's just okay. What are political commissars? Let's see. That's still so bad for organization. So access to the five-year plan is always great. Crime wave. Combined operation, sword and shield of the people, social dissatisfaction still, tank production. Eh, that's just pretty bad. Party maximum? Uh, yeah, as much as I like it, we'll probably get rid of it. The military has made it clear that our officers are hard hindered only by only hindered by our party liaisons. Therefore, the common source must be abolished so the military can do its job. God, I hope we can do its job. Please, do your job. Oh, you saw me still here, though. Oh, look at the Allies. They've gone halfway through Rome. Halfway to uh, Italy, I mean. <laughs> Not Rome. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no, 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 Please. Good operation. God dang it. Yeah, I don't know. I think Joseph Song could use more political power, to be honest here. That doesn't make any sense why, like, it's so bad right now. Especially part of the caucus brothers. Hassan Israelov has announced that his movement now aims not just to end liberate the Chechens and English, but all the Caucasus. To this end, he has formed the special part of the Caucasus Brothers to attract other nationalities of insurrection. Some North Caucasians are joining him, but the fact is still largely contained. And it's my development at best. Okay, so that was not bad. We lost quite a few guys, but we ended up killing 160,000 of them. Nice. As long as Romania. Oh, oh look at that. Let me get a little bigger. We, we're, so, we're so far holding. We're doing a little better than I thought we, we would, honestly. Honestly, we're doing a little better than I thought we would. Going to. Let the tanks just roll on. Oh, the motorized roll on into. There we go. I want to try general attack, but I know it's going to be probably pretty pointless. But, you know, we could try. Hmm. Hellenic Republic. Uh, the Allies are doing not too bad. Not too bad. Nice. Come on. Oh, we actually took another tile. That's not too shabby, actually. I'd love to do more of this stuff. Then again, we might have got more manpower that way, too. We have a. Yeah, I got 3 million more men than we did earlier. I mean, if you guys want to be smart about this, you could just go there. Oh, we lost Honko, huh? The this thing, huh? The also Bisti. The NKVD military counterintelligence officers will be replacing the old commissars, although their work has no political value. They'll make sure that disloyal officers and soldiers are punished accordingly. Go, baby boys, go. And then Um Rodina recovery would be pretty good to do as well. A sufficiently determined soldier can storm a fortress, so we'll make our soldiers more determined. Hey, not bad. Even though losing a lot. Of, oh, oh, crap. The rebellion in Chateau in Dagestan. Guerrillas led by Marekbek, a Sherpop, have taken over Chateau and failed to take Irum, uh, Kael, Itum Kael, in the south of Chechnya. They've joined up with the Israelov and have thus scored a major victory for the insurrectionists. Additionally, the Dagestani rebels have taken over the frontier villages of Novolatskaya and Dilium. There are sure to be a big blow to our operations of the region. We must act soon. Crap. Oh, it's not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Then again, this was core territory, so I mean, what do you kind of expect? 
And again, I need manpower. Like, we need manpower now. Oh, it's not good. Holy crap. Oh, it's not good. 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 It, oh, Chechen soldiers desert. Chechen English soldiers have heard of the recent revolts in the Chateau and have started deserting in rats. Let's have someone deplete our map our pool, but we can recover from this. When the revolt is crushed, we'll, they will see the errors of their ways. Oh my gosh, we need so many guns. Hey, we got Finland though. Hey. Not bad. We're going to race that army south now. Except we'll leave some as garrisons because they will probably try to enable invade us. So now, that's not bad. You guys did relatively okay-ish. Um, I don't want to stack extra soldiers here, but we're going to need to. So you guys go over there. I want you guys, honestly, at this point, you guys just become all horses and stuff like that, maybe, and help defend. You never know if Norway's going to join them. I don't think they will, but you know, you never know. Um, horse boys, yeah, we'll, we'll do the best we can with those guys. U24, something's going to happen down here, and we're not going to like what's going to happen. I'm going to race you guys down here, too. Oh, now just a solid front line, huh? You guys go down there. This is what I wanted earlier. Any upgrades to uh, Winter Expert? Maybe. Oh, do you have another one? No? Okay. Is this a second or first West Russian war? Occupation of Finland, huh? Oh, uh, we'll use that one. Finland's now under control. Should we place it, re release his puppet? Yeah, that's fine. We're going to have to send manpower in there because we have no manpower right now, which sucks, but whatever. Well, at least we got rid of the fence fast. I think that's pretty good. Um, come to the center, then. Are we mobilizing? It doesn't feel like we are. We're getting, like, new manpower, which sucks. After that, 4 to 1. Oh, my goodness. More resource speed, please. Thank you very much. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Don't worry about attacking. Don't, do not worry about attacking right now. Hey, yeah, we'll take some stuff. Yeah, we. Oh, we're doing a lot better now that we're taking their stuff too. Yeah, they're they're slowly trying to push as hard as they possibly can. We've taken a quarter million. We've killed off half a million Germans. Not bad so far. Now this is gonna be god awful. Oh my gosh, we're pushing us back already. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Um. Join the fray. We'll get you a general soon enough. But oh wow, the allies are doing much worse now. Okay. Uh, not sure what we can really do here. Oh, no, there's that manpower. Look at that. So, for all the generals that are here... Uh, any upgrades yet? No? Okay. Romania does look quite depleted, though, actually. Hungary? Uh, they're doing okay-ish. Germany's do doing okay-ish, too. And they're still attacking like crazy, but whatever. Go back in, boys. We're just going to lose a few... Oh, we've lost all that manpower. Holy crap. Um, Odina Nation. Sufficiently determined soldiers can storm a fortress, so we'll make our soldiers determine. Command, max command power increase. It's not bad. Women, 3,000 manpower, though. It's not that great. Move towards the war economy. If we're to survive, we need an immediate turn towards the economy built forever. Or built, not forever, but built for war. Yeah, pretty much, man. Um, keep building. Uh, uh. Here, Central Asia. We love Central Asia here. And that will give us more fuel, which we don't really need more fuel or whatever. I just want some goddamn generals. I mean, casualty-wise, we're doing very well compared to the Germans, so... And I'm, I'm so glad we got rid of the Finns already. Oh, there goes Republic of China. That's not good. Anti-air upgrades. We don't even need really anti-air right now. 41. Some better artillery, please. Oh, wow. This is very ugly. Holy goodness. Holy goodness, goodness, gracious goodness. 
Yeah, they got a lot of divisions, man. Max out Germany is not really a joke, but it could be a lot worse. They, oh, come on. Straight 76. They control most villages in the countryside and it's a very strong base of support. Attacks will come frequently, and if you're not careful, you can be facing an open revolt. Well, there's nothing we can do. Every single time I've tried something, it's not enough. It's just not enough. You can work everywhere, which is pretty good, too. Yeah, work on me would be good. Mobilize the proletariat? Eh, that's not bad. Uh, steel, power, uh, empower Goss plan. It's not too bad. Sacrifice a consumer? Huh. <laughs> and agricultural development's not bad. I think we'll probably do next wars upon us. The enemy has invaded, so we must mobilize the people to stop well, them. Well, everybody, apparently Spain has had some sort of revolt here. Like, they've really butchered up a lot of the stuff here, but we're currently doing wars upon us. Um, if you want to read that one, please go ahead. The enemy has invaded. We must, we must mobilize the people and stop them. It is what it is. Uh, less land is more war support. Why now? They are mobile. There are some political prisoners. We must free the condition that they must, must they, mo they mobilize whatever followers they have, if they have any at all, to serve the nation. Because we could really use that war support. I mean, we could really use it. I just trying to bomb them, and we keep losing here. I don't see the point of this anymore. I mean, okay. Oh, here the casualty too. Uh, let's cut off 1.4 million. I mean, that's, that's that's pretty decent. I did send one spy over to Germany to see what they were up to, and they got some anti-air. They got a lot of anti-tank. They got no artillery, which is surprising. They got tons of guns. Um, yeah, they got tons of support equipment, plenty of t plenty of tanks for now, and three to five million manpower. So really, it's going to take a while for us to kill them off, which is you know okay. Things happen. Um, you guys, not too bad. Um, we're just basically gearing up, getting ready for them to attack us again. Actually, if I can move you guys down south and attack here, push them back over the river, I think that'd be really beneficial. Vasily, just in case, I like this into at a time. There you go. Go to Berlin. See what you can do. Cook up some trouble over there if you possibly can. And uh, maybe put some more air bases around here too. Um, factory wise, we could definitely use more of this. We could use more guns as well. Um, and there go the allies. It's looking probably pretty bad for them, honestly. Oh, and America. Yep, America join. Yep, makes sense. Command of training inter interrogation techniques. This is the economy stuff. We'll see what happens with that. Come on, guys, attack us again. Come on, you guys got this. Two divisions are at least probably 40 combo with. Holy crap. Um, yeah, Germany. Clean that up pretty well. Uh, they're still fighting in Italy, which is good to see. And Athens hasn't fallen just yet, but... I kind of hope Turkey does not join the Allies. I hope they remain... Mandate for Syria and Le Lebanon. Okay, this is... Pretty thick, not gonna lie. Yeah, if these guys join... Oh, we're kind of screwed. Uh, more divisions would be nice, of course. Uh, just in case. Maybe another theater. I don't trust the Turks. I'm sorry. Because the, the Republican Spaniards joined the, the Germans, but... Are you kidding me, man? Uh, take down another cell. There's no point doing that. Western Armenia? We must, I'd rather do that one because this has to guaranteed. If these guys rise up, we might be able to do something here, maybe. Uh, here, get over here. Free political prisoners. Uh, Soviet socialist patriotism? All peoples of the USSR must remember that they serve not just an ideology, but a nation. The Russians, the elder brothers of the Soviet people, will be at the helm. Please don't lose here too much. And ration program. Fight ethnic nationalism. We get more political power. We lose some stability. That's fine. We need an intense rationing program to ensure the Red Army has enough resources to fight. The city dwellers will get a little bit of food, but the peasants will be made to live off their harvest. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Oh, keep attacking, Germany. Keep attacking. Uh, actually, do you have any upgrades? Probably not. Oh, yeah, you do. Yuri. That's so good for max entrenchment. But I want more attack, because we're going to need more attack. Entrenchment is not bad. We're kind of already okay on that already. <sighs> you guys are going to train it, so that's fine. Look at all this. Just, just so many attacks. So many attacks, man. 15 divisions. Is it not enough? It's good for you. I'll go max entrenchment. That's fine. Something happened here? Someone invading us? No? Just... At least the line doesn't move that much. It is already January 42, which is pretty good, but still. I don't think they're getting manpower bonuses, technically, um, with what they with, with their routes. But I could be wrong about that. Since we're here, let's grab some... Oh, yeah, we have not done this stuff. Oh, that's so bad of us. Oh, they're slowly pushing in. Oh, no, 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 no,
because this is not the core territory, so we might have a chance actually actually beating them here. So, oh, let's go over here and do this. Oh, did someone get captured? Hopefully not. No, 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 no. Yeah, never mind. Well, now this is not core territory, so they will have a much tougher time winning there. That's not core territory, so they'll have a tough time winning there too, anyways. So, go ahead and ration stuff for now. Don't worry about attacking. Seriously, don't. <clears throat> it's not bad. Women, manpower, fight ethnic nationalism. And it is the opinion of Comrade Stalin that many nationalities, such as the Baltic peoples and Ukrainians, that were at war against the USSR due to the hatred of Russia. We must stop this as soon as possible. At least for now. At least for now. Just. We better dig, because they're pushing a little bit against us, but, you know, still. It's not core territory, but we suck so hard. I don't even, yeah. Actually, we, we do have some green. That's not too bad, actually. That's better than I thought it would be. Um, we could grab this. Research speed, nuclear physics would be very nice. Yes. Yes. No, yes. Yeah, that'd be good. Awesome. Yeah, they, they're, they're burning themselves out, which is fine with us. Two million have died from us. Awesome. Romania doesn't really want to attack. Racial laws. We love racial laws. Four to five million manpower still. Jesus Christ. I mean, they just... I mean, they got factory output bonuses, but still. Like, oh my gosh. They're still really good on that. Plenty of anti-tank. Fighters are slowly being depleted as well. They don't have a lot of cast. We got a lot of sport equipment, though. They just love attacking like crazy. Which I love, so... Implement Scorched Earth Tactics. I would love to do that. We could try it again, but I'd rather establish order in uh, Karelia, which makes a lot more sense for us. Cool. You're just so brutal. Uh, what do you guys got? Cavalry expert? Nah, not too much right there. Yeah, I mean, we're fighting the French as well. We're fighting the Spanish. Well, not really Spanish, but you know, territories, Spanish territories. Anyone else have upgrades yet? No? Ration program? Nice. And I think nationalism is not going to help us much, but we'll do the best we can. Ooh, don't let them take this, man. Do not let them take this. Yeah, don't send everybody. Just send one division. Well, at least keep one division there. Um, Air Force, Army Troops. It's just not very good on this side here. I guess, uh, review of foreign policy. It's clear that our foreign policy strategies have not prepared us for this eventuality. We must review our policy and adjust when necessary. Nice. But I'd also like to become a spy master. And are we still mobilizing? No, we're not. That sucks. But we should do okay-ish. Oh, crap. They are expanding. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. I know we have the purge and everything, but still. So I'm going to become an infantry leader, skilled staffer, trickster, mountaineer, ranger, urban assault specialist, not bad. Ah, uh, sure thing. Oh my goodness, how much are we lacking, actually? Honestly, not bad. We need a lot more anti-tank and guns, but other than that... Oh, hello, look at the Spanish Republic, they're back. Nice. Um, these tanks are okay-ish. There you go. Dong bye. I did want to. I did say I did want to do this too. So, nice. If you could actually break over that river, that'd be amazing. If you could. Good. 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 Um, and we'll throw you right there, actually. There you go. Alright, not bad so far. Not bad. You guys are holding out okay-ish. Not great, but okay-ish. Um, I'm half you guys there. Of course. Once they actually do rebel, I'm just going to send our guys over here and to just have our tanks go. There 
There you go. If you can. Please, 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 please. Aftermath of the Great Purge. Great. Are you need more generals? I'd love to have more generals, please. Just want to carpet bomb you, that's all. There we go. Another encirclement. Not bad. Beautiful. Sure, guys. In the comment of the Philippines. Yeah, I think we can agree to that one. Alright, so we know we can push into the against the Romanians a little bit. Uh, I've only killed off 2.7 million Germans. Never enough, but whatever. Yeah, we're going to review foreign policy next. They yes, yes, yes. No more defense? Yes, please. Yeah, we, I, I, we're doing better than I thought we would. I'll be honest. Like, after I saw what they were up to, I was getting I was getting pretty worried that we won't be able to do it too much. But we're doing okay. We're definitely doing okay. It's only April 42. We've got maxed out air, naval, and army XP. So, it could be a lot worse. It's going to be slow going, but that's all right. Fine, send half you guys in there too. Send half you guys in there too. You'll be fine. Because we're not having Zuko do this. Seriously, what's the point of that? The revolt. The strong do not weaken them weakly. There'll be an open revolt. 39 days. Operation Lentil. It's good that the insurgency of Chechnya cannot be stopped by modern means. Let's increase the scale of our operations. So stupid. That's the case. Uh, I think it's right here-ish. Here-ish. So, if it's any tanks over here, it's probably a really bad idea, but we'll do it anyways. Let's get ready for them. We should be okay. Are the Germans still attacking? Oh, yes, they are. Uh, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Is that the Republic of China they're talking about? Oh, yeah, I guess it is. Market liberals, huh? Alright, well, good luck, I guess. More millies, I guess. Might as well, right? Oh, oh, crap, 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 crap on a stick. Crap on a heavy stick. Stick crappers, stick crappers. I'm glad I was looking around here. I knew they would eventually invade. And review foreign policy. What's this? I uh, just hear revolts is fine. Well, probably again, it would not be bad, but I do want to do more drastic operations and such, so. We're pretty much ready for them. Oh my god, what the hell is taking you so long? I don't care if the marshes are not. Jesus Christ. Holy crap. Oh, there's some extreme lag. Holy crap, what's going on? Did someone get released or something? I'm going to get we have, we have rebels going to appear soon, but like. What? Are you kidding me? What? That's stupid. Oh, there's that stuff. There goes that. Um, Raider Station Lend Lease. Uh, Raider technology is far beyond the British levels. We should ask the British government for parts that would allow us to build Raider replacements. I'll be honest, this focus feels a little lacking. Alright, well, now with this. They did ask for it, so. Can we not find anything here? Hmm, sad. Quite sad. I want to make it in circle but we just don't have anything. I'm trying to do Operation Lentil as well, but.
try to do it together. Hopefully you do better, but obviously not. Chechen revolt. We've left the insurgency in Chechnya get out of hand, and now rebels by Hisran Israelov have uh, begun to open revolt. Chechnya has been seized by the guerrillas, and local authorities have been overpowered, with some officials being executed. Israelov has declared this day to be the day of the Chechen independence, although it's not clear how he expects to fight with only 50,000 militiamen. I guess we could play with them if we really wanted to, but I'm not interested in them right now. Not very exciting, so. Of course it. You were the sub? Oh, this like a Gongor. That's pretty good. See what you can do up there, I guess. Now we lost our sub, so god dang it. Alright, so we got rid of those guys. That's pretty good. Now we can send you guys up here, but I think we're probably going to end the episode there. Probably. After this one, uh, I'll probably do off screen. Uh, Shithrainya Battalioni? Peter Battalion is also known as Strath Bati. We compose of prisoners, mainly deserters, cowards, and gulag inmates. They'll be a good compliment to our regular soldiers and will make for decent can of fodder. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below. Let me know what are your thoughts on how we're doing and conducting the war so far. And I'll see you tomorrow as we're trying to continue to do well against the ally Axis. Thanks for watching. Have a great, 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 great rest of your day.